infinite scroll pagination in PHP so what is infinite scroll so these are the posts are coming from database and when we scroll bottom it will add some more post it here you can see just one more time let's scroll and you can see let's change it to be uh, a smaller number put it to be a 10 post a scroll a scroll a scroll a scroll so just like a Facebook post when you go scroll down it will automatically uh, show some other post so this is called infinite scroll pagination so let's create a project and understand it so let's close this one so already I have project which is infinite scroll and I have file index.php main.js post.php and style.cs so let's see first index.php this is just html file right I've added the font which is Fira Science it here added the bootstrap and my own CSS file and bottom of that we have added jQuery 2.2.4 using CDN and uh, main.js this is my own JS file so let's see main.js let's check this one and drop it here so main.js have function load a page and I'm passing two parameters page num and loading when we call this one here when your page is load right we are calling function page load and we are passing two parameters first is the page num and page num is by default this one and the loading which is loading is false then also we are calling this same function as when you are scroll when we scroll right but we have a condition when you scroll goes to bottom this line of code then we are calling a function load a page like this so post load a post uh, sending a request to a uh, post.php and it will send page num which is this one it will send a data to page num and page num we know that page num is one right so let's see a post.php let's take this one and drop it here a little bit zoom in they have a function which is post and we are inside these functions we are connecting to our database first uh, using mysqli it will take a four parameters first is host name username and password of your database and database name my database name is infinite underscore scroll, scroll which is this one infinite scroll and post then we are selecting a data using uh, select query so connection and query this connection is an object and we are calling a function of mysql i which is query select all from post order by id descending limit page start and per page so let's zoom out a little bit so per page we want a 20 a 10 if you want 20 if you want 40 40 post per page so at this time it's a 20 post per page when you go to 20 down scroll down it will uh, load another 20 like this yeah so per page we want 20 and if your page page num so this is uh, this page num we will send through ajax right i'll show you in a minute page num so if page num page num is set so page num is by default one and next time when we scroll uh, when we scroll it will be increment incremented by one so here is when we scroll incremented by one page num is plus plus and the page num one it will first time it will be one two three four five six seven eight nine nine ten something like that it will run like this if your page means you just have a only uh, 20 post the page num is 1 
right just only one page it will cover all the 20 post and we are uh, uh we have a logic of page start so page start have a page num means whatever your page num 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 whatever your page minus 1 multiply by per page this per page is 20 so this functions we are calling it here if it is if is set page num and this variable is exactly same as this one page num if it will send page num by default one it will send one from ajax using this page num variable so if it is set we are calling a function which is post and it will take one parameter which is page num and then we are fetching a data uh, from a database using while loop and the data will be our table name which is post and have the uh, have the field which is title and meta description title and meta description and uh, my post i'm putting a class putting a div and inside i'm putting uh, getting title and meta description of the post the next is our id this id uh, index, go to index.php and the id of this div dynamic post so let's copy this this id and go to main.js and here is the dynamic post let's copy and paste if you have another id name it here suppose it have a dynamic uh, post 2 so control s and you have to also put it here dynamic post 2 so it will first time it will be load and then second time it will be append a data because it will send a date sending a data request to a post.php and post.php first time it have a 20 post and then it will be append a data the next is the the ajax loader it have id ajax loader you can give any name of this ids but this here will be same so before to send a request to a post.php it will be so a loader right by default it have a please wait and i have a uh, added the property of css which is display none it will not show by default so it will show then if it is successfully uh, send the request to a server a server to a post.php it will be hide this this id will be same as this one so uh, now uh, we pretty much we have uh, completed but uh, style.css is still uh, we need to see so go to style.css this is just basic css file color painting margin something like so body color is this one and for the family uh, i'm using uh, fira sense so fira sense so it looks uh, pretty uh, good then s3 22 pixels font weight is 400 my post my post is here and uh, my post is background this is a transparent background padding is 20 margin is 10 my post s3 my post and have a, uh, a heading level 3 and its margin top is 0 so it will be uh, here right otherwise if you not uh, put a padding uh, margin 0 it will be this heading will be show it here because uh, by default s3 have some margin and padding and my post dot p it's max hundred three and uh, 650 pixels font size is 16 pixels line height is 1.5 and font weight is 300 which is this one right and as just loader by default it's a display none means it will be not we are not able to see it here by default when we will send the data to on a server by ajax uh, to a uh, post.php it will be a uh, so uh, so on so so ajax loader uh, text center you can see tiny text here when i am pressing control uh, sorry f5 function key of f5 so when uh, i am loading right and i am refreshing you can see tiny text here which is please wait 
and when you scroll it will for short time it will be also be here please wait we are uh, showing your post showing you post so this is a ajax loader so pretty much we have completed so this code also available uh, to download so i will put a link in a description so thanks for watching bye take care